Welcome back out to Detroit Catholic Central High School in Novi, Michigan. They're hosting the South Line Lions in the first round of the Michigan High School Athletic Association basketball tournament. The Lions trail 36 to 27 as we start the second half. Perimeter shot. Rebounded by Schmitz. Just a minute into this third quarter, Remstad sets for three, no good. Lots of whistles in the first half. Doesn't look, doesn't appear as if anything's gonna change here in the second. first team foul the second half they trail by nine if you've been following along with us all season you'll notice that the Lions defense has probably not given up 36 points in the first half all season but give the line offense credit they have answered playing relatively well throughout the first half and shooting the ball well But they trail by 10, 37-27, 6.45 to play third quarter. Nelson. Lions turn the ball over. Swat City from behind. Number 24, Luke Short with a terrific defensive effort. <laughs> South Lion student section going with the he's a sophomore chant. That is true. The 10th grader and third short brother to come through since we've been doing the broadcast. 12 point edge now for Catholic Central. And the Lion offense has got to get something going here early in the third quarter. Nelson to Gould for three. Had a great look at it. Tried to feed the alley-oop. Taylor Say off the left side on the near sideline. Say fakes the three point shot. Barry now with it, creating space in the lane. Would have been a tough shot to get the drop. Three point attempt hits it. Timeout on the floor, 5.13 to play third quarter, 42-27, and the Lion offense has got to get going. Lions break from the timeout, approaching the five-minute mark. Having a hard time getting the offense going here in the second half. Kicked out to Gould, Gould for three. Hits it, big timer. Lion offense needed a spark. John Gold trying to provide an answer. Two pointer called on the floor. It was close. 44 30. Catholic Central leading it. It was a nine point game at the break.
I'd like to thank our third quarter sponsors, Michigan Fleet Solutions, putting you in the driver's seat for all your GPS tracking solutions, sales, service, and installations. That's MichiganFleet.com. As the Shamrocks have opened up a 16-point lead. Outside, look, leaves the air ball. Weidman jumps on it. Under three and a half to go now. In this third quarter being brought to you by Michigan Fleet Solutions. Lions desperately needing better trips from their offense as they turn that one over. Big stop for the line D. Schmidt is fouled as he elevates. Forty six thirty one. Hines missed the second free throw. Gonna need every little point. Fouled in the lane. They're gonna get Noss. Mid-range jumper, no good. Rebounded by Schmitz. And they get him with the call. Doug Host is just disgusted. As is everyone in, in the blue and gold. Baseline and gets the banker to drop. Tough trip for the Lion D there. Schmitz for three. A little strong, and Remstad's not able to get there. 48 31 with 207 to play in the third. You know, we're over here at the new Detroit Catholic Central High School in Novi. It is March 7, 2011, in the opening game of districts. South Lion taking on Catholic Central. Catholic Central has opened up a comfortable 17 point lead, 48 31. And frustration starting to creep in on the side of the Lions. You see all these banners hanging in this new facility over here. And uh, you can't help but remind yourself that most of the Catholic League, in this broadcaster's humble opinion, recruits their players. And is definitely worth being mentioned, at the very least, although they'll deny that they do anything wrong. 136 to play third quarter. It's 48 to 31. Lions trailed by nine at the break. Catholic Central offense has been too much. Now, if you're gonna get one, that's a good foul. Hard clean foul from number 20. 
six-team foul for the Lions. Central gets it inbounded. Just under a minute 25 to play. Third quarter being brought to you by Michigan Fleet Solutions and Dr. Renee Guerin Orthodontics. So Catholic Central will be shooting the rest of the way with 1.15 to play in the third. Hits the front end. That's number 24, Ryan Skronik. Lions had come in winners of their last four, all KLAA crossover games. Got saddled with a pretty tough draw here in the first round with Detroit Catholic Central. They trail by 19 with a minute three to play third quarter. Weidman off the left side. Shot is blocked. Remstad comes away with the loose ball. And he's fouled, but that is CC's only their second team foul. As where the Lions are already at seven, and the Shamrocks will be shooting at least a one and one the rest of the way. 30 seconds left to play, third quarter. Fifty to thirty-one, Lions trail. Winding seconds of the third quarter. We're under twenty to go. Remstad for three, knocks one down. And the Lions are going to need to have more of those. There's Remstad right back on it. Great individual effort. Oh, as he loses a handle on it, and a travel is called. Six and a half seconds left to play third quarter. Lions will try and cut into this 16 point lead. Four seconds. Remstad fadeaway is blocked partially. After three quarters, the Lions trail the Catholic Central Shamrocks 50 to 34. Just underway here in the fourth quarter. Lions trailing 50 to 34. Foul whistle on Catholic Central. It's their team fourth. As the foul slowly even out here in the second half. Tipped away from Luke Short and the Shamrocks convert. 
52-34. Nice shot by number 23, Ryan Nelson, from the left side. Open look from just inside the free throw line, no good. Shots waved off on the foul. Be on number 33, Weidman. Fifty-three, thirty-six, six thirty-seven to play fourth quarter. Remstad fouls as he attacks the basket off the right, left side. <laughs> the 32, Will Hanna checks in for the Lions. Long two pointer, no good. Rebounded by Hanna. Letting them play, but Rumstad gets possession of it on the baseline. 6.01 left fourth quarter. Side shot by Weidman, no good. 54-36, Shamrocks by 18. Lions take over on the turnover. Nice move by Luke Short. Warren the Lions on a delay of game is, excuse me, Ryan Nelson was just friendly, pat of the ball with his boot. The official changed his mind there on the far sideline. Now gives it to the Lions. 5-10 to play, fourth quarter. Starting get, getting down to some really important trips for the line offense. Hanging in the lane, no good. Rebounded by the Shamrocks. Handed off underneath for the finish. 
56-38. Here's Sydney. Get some room in the middle and a travel. Charge drawn by Sydney on the defensive end. Nick Dyer checks in for the blue and gold. Short will draw the foul as he was working hard to create some space in the lane there. 4.07 remaining in the fourth quarter. Short heads the line. Lions running out of time though. Weidman whistled for the foul with 3.51 left to play. Timeout, Catholic Central. Shamrocks leading it 56-39 here in the fourth. Well, with 3.50 left to play in the fourth, the Lions have now finally entered the shooting fouls. Lions trail 56 to 39, 3.50 left to play fourth quarter. Nelson for the block. Six forty one Lions trail turnover three twenty eight left timeout on the floor.
Catholic Central able to get it inbounded. They lead 56-41 with 3.23 to play and another stoppage. It's our 18th stoppage in the second half. The officials have been all over their whistles all game. Hits the first, 57-41, Shamrocks by 16. They opened up a nine point lead at the half and they've been able to build on it here in the second. Dyer off the right baseline. Lays it up and in. We're at the three minute mark of the fourth quarter. Shamrocks leading it 60 to 41. Time running out on the Lions in this district playoff. Give Remstad some credit to get down there and get the slam pass off the nearest Catholic Central player. Sydney hangs in the lane, no good, rebounded, and outlet pass. Plays it up and in off the left side. 153 and counting now, fourth quarter, 62-41, timeout on the floor. Shamrocks lead the Lions 62-41. Just a minute 38 to play in this one. Hannah's fouled as he went up for the shot. Just a minute 30 now left in the Lions 2010-2011 season. They trail by 20. And another foul. Shamrocks comfortably ahead by 20. Catholic Central will move on later this week and play the winner of Northville and Plymouth Salem. And then of course, in the other half of the bracket, it'll be Novi hosting the district final. Short for three. Rebounded by Talaga, his putback is no good. 
and Catholic Central comes away with the loose ball with now just a minute 10 to play in the fourth. Sixty-five, forty-two, with just 50 seconds left now in the fourth. The Lions will fall as that shot is partially blocked. Give the Shamrocks credit. Offensively, they've been able to do something most teams throughout the regular season have not, which is put up 65 points. The Lion offense was there to answer the bell in the first half, but really struggled to get anything, much of anything going in the second half. And so, 32.2 left to play in the fourth. For Matt Boyer on camera, this is Dan Pelchat on Play by Play. We thank you very much for joining us on SLC TV this season. As our fifth season of basketball comes to a close here tonight on the road at Detroit Catholic Central. The Shamrocks will knock off the Lions. They lead it right now 66 to 42 with just 32 seconds left to play. The lead is now 25. Dyer for three. Talaga with the rebound in the lane, kicks back out. From the free throw line, that was partially blocked. Down to 15 seconds. It's number four, Jake Elliott, who will be whistled for the foul. 11.2. Left to run off here. Lions really improved as a team on the back half of this schedule. Like we said earlier in the broadcast, winning four straight coming into this game. And just defensively sound all season. The Shamrocks were able to take care of business on the offensive end of things tonight as they score 69 to the Lions 42. It will be your final score from Catholic Central High School here in Novi. That'll do it for the Lions season. They fall once again 69 to 42 in the district playoffs. We thank you again for joining us. We'll see you next time.